Hi guys, how are you doing today? Couldn't help it, I had to steal my husband's uh, ninja shirt, Just Me, I'm a Ninja, because I'm pretty excited. One of my favorite shows is uh, back, it's a uh, Ninja Warrior. I don't know if you've ever seen it, but uh, originally Ninja Warrior took place in Japan. Uh, there's been, I believe, somewhere around 27 or so uh, different competitions uh, over the years. And um, usually the channel G4 uh, shows subtitled versions of that show. In the last couple of years, they've held contests for Americans to uh, go over and be an American Ninja Warrior. Well, um, this year, they've actually brought... Uh, American Ninja Warrior to America, and they're actually going to do it in, I believe, like Vegas. Um, so it just started again yesterday uh, on G4, and then it's also coming to NBC. So NBC will be showing it on Mondays at 9 o'clock. So uh, it's pretty cool. What Ninja Warrior is is basically just a giant obstacle course, um, but it's pretty cool. The, this stuff is tough. So you see a lot of, like, parkour people and, and stuff like that uh, trying to do it. But... Anyway, a lot of people try, a lot of people fail. Uh, only three people ever have made it to the end of the, the course, so it's pretty amazing. There's essentially four four different uh, levels, if you will. Um, first one, obviously, is the easiest, um, and then goes through, you know, harder as you go. In Japan, they also have the women's version, um, based more on balance and uh, agility and stuff like that. Whereas the, the regular version, women can try out and, and do it. Uh, however, it's mainly an upper body strength kind of thing. So a lot of times women don't make it to the end on that one, unfortunately. But, uh, yeah, I don't know. It's pretty cool. And watching the show makes you want to go exercise, you know. Um, the uh, Japan version, uh, I watched uh, quite a few years of it. And, uh, I don't know, my favorite person on there was Makoto Nagano. Uh, he has actually made it to the end, so that was pretty cool. But, I don't know. Like I said, I'm excited that it's back on TV. Uh, for those of you who did not get G4, uh, like if you have Direct TV, they, they cut G4 as a channel. Um, but you can, like I said, see the show this year on uh, NBC, so that's pretty cool. Uh, so you should definitely check it out if you haven't. And uh, like I said, if you've been missing it since you haven't had G4 for the last, like, two years, uh, now you can catch it again, so it's pretty cool. You know, it's got obviously going to be a little different because it's just American version, um, but it appears that the obstacles are, are pretty uh, much the same, so it uh, should be just as good as, as the other show. Um, but anyway, I was pretty excited about it, so I thought I would uh, share that with you today. Uh, another show I saw last night was uh, America's Got Talent. Now, that's entertaining. Have you ever watched that show? There were some pretty crazy people on there. Uh, I mean, there were some cool people, too. I mean, some people are just amazing. Like, I had a couple singers that were really good and and that. Uh, and uh, there was an old lady on there who, was, who did, like, a rap when she was, like, 80 years old. She was out there in her walker and uh, doing a rap, so that was pretty funny. But, um, hey, you know, good for her for following her dreams and, and trying to do what she's got to do. Just shows you you're never too old. Uh, to do what you want to do. Same with Ninja Warrior. There was a, a guy in his 50s uh, that made it through the first stage and it was just to prove that age is just a number. So that's cool. So it's a, a good message to everybody to just do uh, what you want to do and, and reach for your goals. But anyway, I've just been kind of lazy lately, so I've been watching a little bit of TV. So uh, like I said, those are two shows that I, I caught last night. So um Anyway, that's pretty much it. Nothing overly exciting has happened on my end. So uh, with that, I think I'm going to go and uh, get back to Diablo. I've been playing Nightmare Mode. It's interesting. Uh, things take a little bit longer to kill. It's not necessarily harder, per se, but uh, it definitely takes longer to kill things, for sure. But anyway, I'm going to go do that. And uh, like I said, catch Ninja Warrior tonight, NBC. It's a good time. Have a good day. Thanks for listening.